Hey, what up my cruisers? And in this video, we'll be camping at the Joshua Tree, BLM, Bureau of Land Management, Campground, south of the Joshua Tree National Park. Now, before we get to the campsite, we initially wanted to camp at the National Park itself. However, when we arrived, we arrived pretty late in the day and there were no more campsites available. So while we're looking for a space to camp, we got flagged down by this lady who said her truck was, was towing a full-size RV trailer, by the way, ended up getting stuck in the sand. Click above to see that video as we managed to get them out. The link will be in the description as well. So after all that hard work digging them out, we just wanted to get, you know, a quick spot to camp so we could have dinner, you know, relax and get some rest for the next day ahead. We managed to find a big enough spot for all of us as we were pretty deep, nine rigs deep, I might add. So we needed some good area. So join us and check out how the camp ended up and I hope you enjoy the video. All right, let's cruise. Looking for a camping spot because the campground is full. So we got BLM campground right here. Plenty of people camp free. Looking for a nice spot. Bunch of RVs out here, you know, cars. Got it on his laptop. Five hours later. We set up camp. We finally found a good spot which as you guys can see, look at the beautiful scenery. I mean, you're literally right there by the mountainside. And the cool thing about it is you're only like a few hundred feet from the park entrance, this BLM campsite. And according to Campedium, it got at least a four out of five for all the ratings and the cell phones coverage is pretty good here as well. And I can attest to that as I did not run out of service over here and I have T-Mobile, so. I mean, this area, you can pretty much access it even if you have an RV, a car, anybody can park here. And it's just like most BLM campsites, it's totally free. And you can camp up to 14 days at a time. And also dogs are allowed, you know, pets. The only thing is, uh, if you have like an RV, there's not really any hookups or anything because it's, it's a BLM, Bureau of Land Management campground. So it's pretty much as uh, primitive and uh, as you can get. So make sure you can make your own bathroom or bring a porta potty and bring toilet paper as well. Also, if you're gonna come here, make sure you leave no trace and campfires are allowed as long as there's no fire ban. So after we set up camp, we got a little hungry. Everybody started making dinner. So check out some of the Filipino food we had for dinner. <laughs> We got ve vegetarian Instagram. Uh, Facebook. Facebook. I got Facebook too. My John Friendster. Friendster. MySpace. You got my <laughs> No, no. What's the morning? I no. I, I had MySpace. I had MySpace. How old are you? Uh, I'm old. I'm old now. I had MySpace too. No, oh, no. You had a MySpace. Oh. Just on my Friendster. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 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 That's a fire right there. I don't know. I don't know whose tent is that. <laughs> so after we ate, you know, had those little marshmallows by the fire, we all pretty much just went straight to bed and we were all pretty tired. 
and uh, I'll see you guys in the morning. The next day. Morning, y'all. My little setup in here. So I usually, I usually uh, change my clothes into whatever. If it's dirty, like my pants are dirty, so I change out of them. Then I crawl in here. Got my little charging station right here. Ninja bat. Link in the description for that. And I also have a review on it. You want to check that out? Uh, and I have a video on how I got all this stuff, including the platform and the description as well. I'll probably link it. I'll probably link it on the video. And I tell you, look at that sun rise, guys. Uh, here near Joshua Tree National Park. It's pretty cool. Ugh. All right, well, nature's calling right now, so I gotta do some real quick. Then I'll let you know uh, when we eat breakfast or something. But yeah. So the good thing about sleeping in your vehicle, it took me like five to 10 minutes to finish on, finish packing up while everybody else was still, you know, taking down their tents and sending everything back into their vehicles. I was just chilling, brushing my teeth. Check my oil, check my, check my um, under here, everything looks tight. Check my coolant, my breather hose for the differential is popped off right there. So I'd hook it back in and we should be ready to go. Well, there you go my cruisers thank you for watching this video that was our little camping experience at joshua tree blm campground and don't forget to like and comment hit that subscribe button turn your post notifications on and stay tuned because we got an off-road adventure coming up soon so stay tuned for that and i'll see you on the next adventure all right the easy cruiser out